So guys, our new stroller has arrived today. It came in the mail. Um, we ordered it online a, a couple of weeks ago. So we've been eagerly anticipating its arrival and it is finally here. It took us a while to choose which one we wanted. But... Yeah, we didn't know what stroller we were gonna get. We had to do lots of research. Um, to figure out what pram we wanted, um, pram or stroller. I actually don't know what the difference between those two words really is. I think most people say stroller. Um, but yeah, it took us a little while to figure out what we wanted um, in a pram and if we were gonna buy one brand new or if we're gonna buy one second hand. When we had the triplets, um, we obviously had a double stroller. We actually had two double strollers. <laughs> they were both the same stroller. One was just a newer model, one was an older model. They were called Baby Jogger City Select. One was red, one was blue. But sometimes we'd swap the seats so that like they looked the same, like with one red seat and one blue seat. If you guys watch our old videos, you'd probably <laughs> remember that. And we used to use those um, mostly for the triplets and Felix because Felix was only 13 months old when the triplets were born and so he was still very much a baby himself um, and we also used baby carriers a lot too and we will probably use baby carriers this time too but we also just wanted to make sure we had a pram if we need it. So what we decided to get for the twins is a Bugaboo Donkey Twin Pram. And one of the main reasons we chose this pram is because it's a side-by-side -side, um, stroller instead of like a tandem one, I think they're called. Like, so the ones we had for the triplets, they were both tandem prams. So one baby goes in the front, one baby goes in the back. But this one's gonna be a side-by-side so you'll be able to see both of the babies at the same time. And that's sort of the main reason why I chose this one. I also wanted one that could face the parents, not just outways. And yeah, so we're really excited about this one. And yeah, we're gonna set it up now. That's what do you say, thing, heavy? It's heavy. That's one thing yeah. people actually say about this pram, like one downside. Oh, it's really heavy. People say it's heavy, yeah. And that's that the for... seat. Okay. And that other box is for the other seat. Yep. Yeah. Alright. So this is how far we've gotten and we might need to watch a video on YouTube or something. Yeah, a tutorial. <laughs> Put the wheels in. Wait, I did this first or something. Can you not break it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. They make it look really easy. Why doesn't that flick up? <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. Is that what you needed? Hope so. I'm just gonna make sure it actually fits through a doorway because I'm guessing we're gonna be going through a lot of doorways with it. Uh oh, is it a tight squeeze? Yeah, but... It fits? It does. Yay! <laughs> So the stroller comes with two seats and you can convert them into bassinets. We're going to be putting the bassinets on rather than the regular seats because we will be using it for newborns. Which is exciting. We haven't actually used a bassinet with a pram before, have we? No, we, never. I think we've used capsules a lot and that's why, but we're not going to be using capsules this time. Capsules are like the car seat that can go on the stroller and then you put it in the car, but we'll just be using the zero to eight car seats. So we've made the bassinets and we're gonna stick them on the pram. Oh, but we want them facing in, that's why. Oh, okay. 
because remember they're meant to face us. Yeah. Cool, so we can have one facing this way and one facing that way. <laughs> so when they're arguing with each other. Oh, uh, that's so cool. <laughs> you know, because newborns totally do that. Does it have a basket underneath it? Yes, it should have like a, at least a piece of fabric that goes on there somewhere. So the pram is completely finished. La! I love it. It looks so nice and it is so nice to steer. What do you think? Yeah, I think it's awesome. It moves really well. Yeah. And uh, it's exciting to be able to see them both. It is, yeah. Because we did look at a lot of other strollers and none of them really like looked that way and that way, like interchangeable. Or like you could turn them out front and yeah, forward. Yeah. Yeah. And also when we had the triplets, we had the tandem strollers. Yeah. So we one baby was always a bit more behind the other one. Yeah. And the city select was really good because it was um, had a big basket and stuff. And it, it was really suited us because we had six young children. Yeah. But now we only have two. So this is good in lots of other ways. Yeah, the city select was good. And I also do worry about how wide that's going to be. Yes, but yeah. I Actually, think it'll be worth it. We still didn't test if it goes out the door with the bassinets in it. I don't know. We'll find yeah, out really eventually. <laughs> yeah, I think it's really cool. You'd want to hope so for the price. <laughs> <laughs> when you're um, having twins and people say two for the price of one. Yeah. It's like, no, two no. for the price of two. <laughs> that being said, we didn't have to buy such an expensive pram, but we wanted to because we figured we'll be using it for a really long time and they do resell um, pretty well afterwards. So yeah. we had, there were a lot of thoughts that went into making the decision. Yeah, exactly. And yeah, happy that we made it in the end. What do you guys think? It's the baby's pram, yeah, it's the baby's yeah. stroller. It's just one pram. It's one double pram, so oh both of the babies are going to go in there. Oh, <laughs> one, two, <laughs> two, <laughs> Are you a baby pearl? <laughs> and then we're practicing putting the twins around. <laughs> so we can help. So this is how it will be set up for when they're very little because it's uh, these are the bassinets. Yeah, you can put stuff down there. Put the baby's things down there, the things that we might need to bring out for them. Yeah, maybe some milk or some nappies. Maybe a dummy, yeah. And some babies will go in Yeah, the babies will go in there, won't they? maybe when we go to the park, we can put things in there. What if we put a baby, third baby in here? A third baby? What third baby? Oh, if we have a secret third baby. If we have a secret triplet. Yeah, no. <laughs> that would be funny. <laughs> but where would it actually go? So guys, do you know how long it's going to be until the babies get here? No. Like just a week now? No, not quite that soon, but it's so only going to be... Five weeks. About five, six or seven weeks. We don't really know That's yet. That's like a month too. Yeah, it's a month to a month and a half. I was thinking seven or six or five. Yeah, we don't really know yet because they come when they want to, won't they? We don't really know when that's going to be. Cool, so that's so much fun, isn't it, guys? Yeah. <laughs> All right, we're going to end this video now. Bye, guys. Bye.